is this good lighting? Am I looking purple? If so, that's a great thing. Come with beach till I had to leave the whole alone. I'm by my cheese from alone. A hundred problems get them gone. Wait till I get in my zone. Look at me in the end zone. Touchdown, nigga, it's on. Don't call on my phone. Brand new whip, hop out, let it pop on its own. Bitch, I'm fly like a drone. Bitch, I'm fly. Hey y'all, welcome and welcome back to my channel. It's your girl with Asia. If you're new here, what's up with you? Huh? <laughs> Thank you so much for tuning in to this video. And for my returning subscribers, my returning viewers, what's up with y'all? Y'all are the real MVP. I ain't lying. I could not keep on going without y'all. For real. I've been on YouTube now for about three years. Maybe four. Um, inconsistently. And that's going to change. I promise you guys that I will be consistent. Just throwing you guys bingers. Just so y'all get to know me and I get to know you. Just like that. Just like that. We are currently sitting at 1,130 subs. I believe. Let's keep it going. Let's keep it going. That's lit. That's lit. I, I could not be here without y'all. For real. For real. But let's hop into the video. So, I was always into perfumes, right? I was. Did I wear them like that? Here and there, okay? When back in high school, um, I wore a lot of Bath and Body Works and I just used, you know, your normal soap, your lotion. That would make me smell good personally. My shea butter always was into that. That would make me feel good personally and smell good. <sighs> but let me tell you, I've gotten older, y'all. I've been into perfumes more. A lot of these were gifts. And it just had me, it just made me do a whole flip -a it, it really did. And I just, I've been hooked. I've been hooked. I'm trying not to be one of the girls. Have y'all seen on YouTube the girls who be having all these products? I mean, they have a freaking store in their crib. Nope. Not trying to be that. That's not what I'm trying to be, okay, at all. But I do have a collection, but I'm not trying to have an entire store Eventually, I'm gonna stop. I'm not gonna be no quarter. I don't wanna do none of that. Before, wait, wait, wait. Before we really hop into this video, let me show y'all the candle that I'm currently using. After my shower, I burn a candle or whatever, and it smells delightful. Let me let me show y'all. It's my it's my, my favorite one. Hold up. <laughs> ah, yes, ma'am. Hold up. Is it focusing on my hands? Are you serious? There we go. It's the pineapple mango. Pineapple mango. Let me put it back. I have two of those and I got one big one from Bath and Body Works. And I'm gonna do a candle haul too. So it just I'm just preparing y'all. Like I'm not just doing perfumes. We smell a good all 2022. That means in every aspect you can even think of. That's yeah, that that what we doing. Let's hop into perfumes. Which one should I talk about first? I'm gonna talk about her first. Rebecca Minkoff. Hold up. It's trying, to it's trying to focus on me. There we go. Rebecca Minkoff. Let's talk about her first. Um, I don't have... Well, I have a box for it. I'll do a cut screen. But it's we got it in this big box. It came in three sizes. Yes, it came in three sizes. It came with the travel one, the smaller one, and the bigger one. This is the bigger one. And... I still love it. I think we got it like two years ago, maybe three years ago, two, three years ago. And we got it during Black Friday on sale. <laughs> this was an OG. This was literally the only perfume I was rocking. Besides like body sprays and stuff, like actual perfume, this was the only perfume I was rocking. I didn't have any other one. Um, I had roll-ons. I don't know if that counts. Does that count? Yeah, I think it counts. I had roll-ons. We could talk about that in another video. Maybe I didn't bring my roll-ons here. I'm sorry, but... This one, I love it. Rebecca Minkoff is was my first, I, it's not my first perfume, but I consider her as an OG because we've been rocking with each other for a minute. Every time I put it on going somewhere, mm, you smell good. I'd be like, hey, thanks. <laughs> Thank you. I'm rating her an eight out of 10. She gets an eight out of 10 for me. To me, it's, it's it does give grown women, but it also gives slight. Like we not, we not talking grown women going on a date you know, with the dress on and the heels. We're not talking that. We're just talking grown woman going out shopping, maybe, okay? Uh, grown woman just enjoying her day type of thing. Grown woman going maybe grocery shopping. <laughs> it smells good. To me, it's a good daily, everyday smell, and I give it an 8 out of 10. 
So next one. Next one. Good girl. I really hope it focused on me. If not, I'm sorry, but this one I just got put on too. It was a gift. <laughs> Y'all cannot tell me. You can't tell me this is a nice this this is a nice bottle. It's so freaking pretty. Um you just spray it like they they go to push right there and it come out right there and then and you just spray it on you. I, I gotta give this is a nine and a half out of 10 for me. It's a nine and a half. It is a sweet, but, but, but subtle, subtle. I, I don't know how to explain this, but it is the perfect scent for me. This is also to me, it's another everyday scent. I, I gotta spray it on there. I think I wanna wear this for the day. <laughs> Smells amazing. Did I give it a nine and a half? It might be a 10. <laughs> this, this might be a 10. Um, I know that she has different ones, but this is the one I have. I have the good girl one. Here's the box again. It smells amazing. There's nothing to really talk about, but you should definitely go to Macy's, Dillard's. I don't know, whoever else sells. Kohl's, Kohl's, whoever sells this. I don't know who sells this, but go anywhere who sells this and spray it on you for the one time. I'm pretty sure you're going to fall in love with it. Eight out of 10. If you don't like sweet scents, probably not. But I love it. I gave it a nine and a half. It, it might be a 10, it might be a 10. We're gonna stick with the nine and a half. Stick with the nine and a half for now, but it, it might be a 10. It's one of my favorite ones. My mom trying to take this from me and I ain't letting her. I'm not letting her take this from me. She can use it. <laughs> and she trying to take that from me. It smells amazing. That nine and a freaking half. It might, it might be a 10, but we're gonna stick with the nine and a half for now. So let's do the next one, Burberry. This says Burberry uh, Brit Sheer. This is what the bottle looks like, hold up. I gotcha, I gotcha. Oh, here's the box. I don't know, I hope it focused, but here's the bottle. Yeah. <laughs> It's a plain but cute bottle. Like, it's a cute, plain bottle. I love it. I love it. And I like the scent too. If I had to rate this scent, it would be a seven out of 10. Um, It's not my favorite, but I do really like this scent. This is different. Hold on, let me just spread it. Now my room gonna be smelling like it. Yeah. Yeah, I gave it a seven out of 10. Just comparing it to Good Girl already, just comparing the two is like, ah, Good Girl one, obviously, but just alone, it do smell really nice. I really like this. This is, will be something where I'm not trying to smell too strong for the day. I don't wanna be smelling like everything or I don't wanna be smelling heavy. This is what I would pair with Caress, you know, your daily, your regular smelling stuff. I, I, I like this, I like this. So seven out of 10 and the bottle is cute. I think the bottle's cute, so seven out of 10. So there's that one. Which one should I do next? I'm gonna do my next one. I'm gonna do this next one. This next one is my favorite. She's my favorite. She is between her and Good Girl. She also gets a nine and a half, 10. Nine and a half, 10. She is my favorite, I love her, okay. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> I don't need to spray this. And I don't need a reminder. I, I'll give it a 10. I'll give it a 10. I don't need a reminder of how this smell. Co Coach Dream Sunset. I think Coach has different ones. And I know a lot of people like the one. I can't, I don't know the name of it. But <laughs> this one by far is my favorite perfume. I'm so surprised at the amount that I use. Actually, no, I'm not surprised. I'm really not surprised because I wouldn't wear this every day. I wear this on certain occasions. And if, anytime I want to smell sweet, she is the one, she's the one to put on. I'm telling you, this is my favorite perfume. This is a rebuy. Like when I run out, I'm going to get another bottle for real. 
This is a rebuy. Good Girls a, a rebuy. Um, Burberry. I don't know. It might. I don't know. It's, it could be a rebuy, but well, I probably won't think about it. But these two, this one. Let me pull it out. These two are definitely the top of my list. They're both rebuys. I will repurchase these, even though they. Uh, oh, I bought this one, but this one was a gift. Yeah, I I I recommend these two. Now, I don't recommend it to the point where it's sold out. Don't do that. If this video gets numbered and it's sold out, I'm mad at y'all. <laughs> I'm going to be mad at y'all because this one. Oh, she's like that. Like, 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 sis. Sweet. If you like sweet. I know some people don't really like sweet scents. And if so, that might not be your scent. But I love her. And she stays on a long time. Like, I think I'm starting to smell like it, like my natural smell. I love it. I love it. I love it. Next one, next one, because I don't want to drag this video. Um, let's do Versace. Versace. It was also a gift. The bottle, now I got to give it to him. The bottle is a 10 out of 10. Like, look how it looks. The bottle is gorgeous. The bottle itself is a 10 out of 10. Look at this. It got, it says, hold on, let me back up. It says Versace. There we go. The bottle, let me show y'all the top of this. This is Dylan Turquoise. Versace. I will also give this a 7 out of 10. Hold on, let me smell it again. Well, hold on, let me smell it again. Gosh, I'm about to be smelling everything. I just got the shower. That's okay. Ooh. I give her a seven out of ten. Six and a half. Six and a half. It don't smell better than Burberry, but again, to me, if you want to smell, this scent to me is light. It's giving, it's giving going outside type of scent. But it smells good. It's just, I don't know. Maybe it's not sweet enough for me. But it do smell good. It, it's giving grown though. It's giving grown. It's giving spring, summer. I wouldn't put this for winter. So it's not all year round, but I mean, shoot. I spray it when I want to. If I feel like I want to spray it in January, that's when I'm gonna spray it. <laughs> I think it's the best looking bottle, but it's not the best scent out of all of mine. But it does smell good and I definitely would wear that, especially comparing to uh, soaps and things of that nature and speaking of i plan on doing those videos too so i'm starting off with a perfume video but we're gonna dive into the bath and body works and the dove and the caress and all that stuff all that stuff shower routines all that stuff let's do the last one which is definitely one of my other favorite scents it's not the top two like i said but it is it is number three is this jimmy choo um illicit flower and this bottle is, it's, it's pretty. It's a pretty bottle. It's a pretty bottle. Let's see. Oh, my, there we go. I'm gonna put the box there. Again, I'm sorry. I know the, my camera, it wanna focus, it wanna focus on me. <laughs> the bottle is pretty. Um. I give the bottle, I'll give the bottle an 8 out of 10. I think it's a pretty bottle. Um, the smell, I will also give it an 8 out of 10. It is, if you do not like flower scents, it is not for you. Um, I know my mom, she's not a fan of anything flower scented, but see, I am. I do love me a good flower smelling something. And this, I'm so happy. I got this as a gift, by the way. I'm so happy that is a flower scented perfume. I have one because I have flower scented bath stuff and now I could match it with this. <laughs> Hopefully this will overpower that, but you know, I love it. I give it an eight out of 10 and I do recommend it if you like flower stuff, because if you don't, again, if you don't like flower stuff, it's not gonna be for you. So the look of it, I give it an eight out of 10. The smell of it, I give it eight out of 10. Oh, let me show y'all what I'm wearing now. I didn't even show y'all that. This is what I'm wearing right now. 
Okay, I'm sorry. It, what if I did it from back here? I don't know. I don't want to focus, but this is Bath and Body Works, and this is the scent Restful Moon in the Aromatherapy scents. That is my favorite Bath and Body Works for right now because Bath and Body Works, again, we got to make a separate video. They got so many good scents, and they got this one scent that I'm not going to say. They got this one scent that I do not have yet, but I will have, and I think it's perfect for spring, perfect for summer. And uh, yeah, uh, we just go we just go keep it at that. I don't want to say too much. Um, I want to bring y'all with me when I purchase it and everything, like scrubs and all, like all of that. But yeah, this is what I'm wearing now, and it is one of my favorite scents as of right now. I got the soap and the perfume and the lotion. That's it. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and put some more of this. Hopefully, I don't smell like Versace or what else I sprayed. Good girl. I don't know. But yeah, those are those are all of my these are all of my those are my luxury perfumes for right now. That's the start of it. We're going to get more eventually. But yeah, that's it. Did y'all enjoy the video? I hope you did. Um do y'all like my new intro for those who've been following me already? For those who um are new to my channel, do you like my intro? I try to do, my intro is the same song, but it's different. It don't have, I'm not in it no more. My name is up there and it, it got, I don't know. I feel like it, it's a little more from my age now, I guess you'll say. But don't get it twisted. That's still my type of music. <laughs> like I love R&B music, but that's still my type of music too. And that brings up another point I'm going to do, or if I haven't done already, I'm going to do a playlist haul. So if it's already done, it'll be up here. But if not, stay tuned. Uh, check check, uh, check my channel. I might have already did it. So yeah, I'm gonna warn you. I'm gonna warn you. Even though I changed my intro, my outro is still the same. So this is a warning. You got headphones in. Three, two, one. Bitch, I'm flat.